Oh yes, it's that time again, time for another blind box review. As you all know, I have done these Funko blind boxes for quite some time, and I started the series off with these sci-fi figurines. As you can see, I've collected five of them so far. I got myself a nice little Robocop, the robot from Forbidden Planet, E.T., Invisible Predator, and Flynn from Tron. However, I went to Hot Topic recently and discovered that Boom! Series 2. It's new because it's 2. Yes, Series 2 of the sci-fi sci science fiction vinyl figurines from Funko has come out. It's the Mystery Minis. And we take a look at the box. I'll show you some of the characters. We have... Well, let's just go to the list. Let's go to the full list here. Alright, who is... Who do we have for Series 2? We got a Queen Alien... We got a person with a head hugger on them. The oh my god, I keep forgetting their names. They uh, ba, 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 uh Cylon. I think this is a Cylon from I think Battlestar Galactica. Neo from the Matrix. A Borg. I believe maybe someone from Firefly. The helmet's throwing me off. Doc Brown. I'm pretty sure that's maybe Kirk from Star Trek. Um, the guy from Galaxy Quest, Voltron, I actually remembered his name today, Godzilla, the giant from Iron Giant, Lilu from Fifth Element, a gold bender, and why not Zoidberg? Okay. As per usual, one go. Four, eight fifty. I thought this was a four fifty. Huh, oh well. I got it for half off, so I don't care. So let's open the box. That. Rip that open. Here. Go to focus and look at those. And we got the usual. Oh, yes, there's definitely a figure in here. And tear open the trash bag from another universe. Only to realize that, da -da -da, that it's. Oh! Well, isn't that nice? It is Doc Brown looking quite haunted with his scream the painting eyes I mean, look at him I mean, he, this, he's seen some crap I mean this is not the happy excited Doc Brown who like saw the DeLorean go back in time I mean he, it's like he witnessed the murder of his parents like he's playing his video game or an RC car and he walks in and he's like oh, great Scott they're dead he, he, he looks absolutely horrified what did this man see? Well, let's check the rare. Here, you go with the group. Play nicely with the children now. All right, let's see. Doc Brown. Let's see, there he is. Focus, thank you. One out of every 24. That's cool. All right, I like that. It's a character I do enjoy. Personally, I would have, uh, I think the Queen Alien is the one I'm aiming for. So I keep collecting those for a Queen Alien. I would not mind the Iron Giant, Lilu, Galaxy Quest Guy, and to a lesser extent, even Voltron. But I am really gunning for these two alien figurines. That's one out of 12, but that is one out of every 72. Good gracious. Oh, I might even go for a Zoidberg. One out of six. But watch. I want to get like 12 of these boxes. Half of them will be all Zoidbergs, and then I'll just have a clone of Zoidbergs. But there you go. As usual, these are very nicely made. They have a kind of a clay feeling to them. But they're pretty solid. These things have fallen off my desk before and no real damage. You got a little serial number down there. Made in China. But yes, it's good good quality as usual. Good attention to detail. You could definitely tell that's Doc Brown the moment you look at him. But those eyes, those horrible, horrible eyes. It's a manic depressive, Doc Brown. There you go. But there you go. There's Series 2 of the Science Fiction Vinyl Figurines. I'm hoping that now that we have a Series 2 of the Sci-Fi, we'll get Series 2 of the Horror. Ooh, scary stuff. I really look forward to seeing the horror ones. Alright, well there you go. Thank you for tuning in, and I'll see you next time.